everyone, Dylan Schumacher, Citadel Defense, and I hope that you are having, will have, have had a wonderful Thanksgiving. So I've been thinking about this for, I don't know, four to six weeks now. And I've been thinking about the importance of beauty uh, to the human spirit and to the human soul. And uh, I've taken a break from reading uh, tactical books for the past couple weeks. And don't worry, uh, tactical book reviews are coming back. We're still going to do that till I'm dead. But uh, I've just taken a little break here, a little hiatus. And right now I am reading The Silmarillion by J.R.R. Tolkien. And after that, I plan to read The Hobbit and Lord of the Rings. Now, I've read all of these books before, uh, but I'm going back to read them again. And one of the reasons that I'm going back to read them is that I want to experience beauty. And I want to experience that that depth and greatness and glory of the soul. And those books capture it extremely well. And on Thanksgiving, I thought it would be a good time to reflect on that and reflect on the need of the need for beauty to be ingested into the soul. Uh, in a world where there is so much ugliness and degradation and depravity and just general you know, decline, it's important to remember that there are beautiful things worth living for, worth dying for, worth pursuing. There are things like virtue and honor and glory and beauty. These are things that exist and have existed since God created the earth and will exist uh, into eternity forever, right? These are things that are real. And they may not be tangible, like, like you can see, taste, touch, tangible, but they're real nonetheless and they affect the life and the soul. And again, they're going to help shape and define your soul. And if you are ingesting beauty, right, in, in different facets of life, then that is going to help you as a human being and as a fighter because it reminds you what you're fighting for. But if all you ever do is have a steady diet of, of depression and ugliness, right, like, like on Twitter, right, there's a substantial amount of ugliness. And if that's all you're ingesting, well, uh, of course, that's going to make you an ugly person. So this Thanksgiving, you're probably uh, hiding in some closet to watch this video real quick away from your liberal aunt or something, right? I want you to just take a moment and remember that there is still beauty in the world, right? And that it's important to remember that there are still good things and virtue that are out there that are important, that we need to cherish all the more. We need to be thankful for the beauty that we do have and that we can still receive, right? And we need to remember that there's a time coming after the decline, you, may, you and I may or may not live through it, where beauty will once again be valued and held up. And uh, I don't know, I hesitate to say that glorified, like we're going to worship it, but, but given a place of honor, let's say, right? Where those things will be held up again as, hey, there are virtues and, and honors that are good and right. And we as a society are going to uphold those. That time's coming again, okay? It's going to happen. Again, you and I may or may not live to see it, but it's coming. So, I hope that gives you something to reflect on this Thanksgiving. I hope that gives you something to be thankful for this Thanksgiving. Do brave deeds and endure.